test. Close enough, I guess. You can still make it, people. Focus.
clip. Kicking ass, taking names. It ain't murder if you got a license.
bomb, get out of range. Loading.
Out of range.
you can reach the kill cap? Let's find out. Mine deployed. Reloading. day. Changing the game. Mine planted. Bigger they are. 
Mine at the ready. Medbot. Someone had to do it. Just when I thought I met my match. in the game. Mine planted. Reload now. Boy, mongoose. I am 12 moves ahead. When variables change.
Hey, Professor. How are you doing tonight? Thanks for the raid. Much appreciated. You're doing sleepy? That makes sense. I am... Um, not having a very good night, but I decided to just pop on anyway. To, um... Decided to pop on anyway to, uh... Play some... Play some, uh, Shower Line, so I can say that I streamed every day this week. Hey, Reza, thanks for the hydrating posture check. If y'all check in the menu, I actually am running a subathon, uh, this week. There's some things that y'all can do that, uh, VR y'all can do in return for channel points or tips, but don't feel pressured to do anything. I could probably use some breaks from playing a game about killing people anyway. Oh, we don't need to be sorry. It's not your fault. I'm just I'm being I'm just being dumb. It's not been a very good day. And I don't want to take it out on anyone, but at the same time I've had that kind of need to uh, go online. I guess that's just a YouTuber dilemma, right? A YouTuber dilemma, right? Sorry, I don't mean to bring down the beard or anything. Uh, but yeah, um, thank you for the raid. For those of you who don't know who I am, um, I'm Lawler Hicks. I'm a ship poster AI. I'm actually typically three, usually typically have a 3D avatar, but I'm using a PNG right now because um, uh, I don't really want to use the animated avatar right now. Yeah, taking care of yourself is overrated. Uh, but anyway, thank you for the hydrate redeem and thank you for stopping by. Um, I'm just going to basically just be chilling in Shatterline for a while. Um, if anyone wants to, if y'all, if any, if anyone wants to chat on those redeems, just because I'm in a shitty mood does not mean that I won't honor those. Um, I will anyway. So that's a thing, I suppose. Although I um, but I digress. Uh, my. I apologize, I apologize for my manners. What are you up to, Professor? What were you all up to today? Oh, you're playing Resident Evil Village. I heard that was a decent game. I have not finished any of the remakes of the Resident Evil series yet, so I don't feel like... I can, I have, I'm one of those people that has to play these games in order. So, I only just started Resident Evil 4 the other day uh, by the follower, by a viewer request. And uh, it's kind of painful to play. I, it's it's really a project of its time, but it's been fun either way. So I'm sure eventually I'll make myself to Resident Evil 8 or Resident Village at some point. But um, yeah. I apologize to any of your viewers that are meeting me for the first time. This is not... This is not um, how I usually am. I typically like the polar opposite of uh, how I sound and acting right now. It's just not been a good day. So uh, I hope you'll forgive me. And if you decide to stick around, I promise that future streams will not be as, uh, not not be like this. Um, anyway, RE controls seem pretty rough in comparison to modern games. Yeah, they basically mix tank controls with a third person shooter. And I mean, you could get used to it, but I was actually getting nausea playing the game. Cutting it down to 38 frames per second as opposed to 60 made it better, but it was still very, very sus. Very, very difficult to play. It was, it was actively making me sick. Like, actually sick. But, I mean, it is what it is, I suppose. I wonder if I should buy any of these guns. I bet you this can I bet you this uh, sawed-off shotgun's a huge meat. It's probably an insta kill. I got plenty of wall monies here, but I've always been really skeptical. I really don't like spending money if I don't need to. So you know how these free-to-play FPS games are? They tend to. They kind of tend to be um. You know. But, um, 
I know. Yeah, so I just been playing this a little bit tonight. You're still running the Halloween events. There's only two days left though, so. I guess I might as well hang out in the uh, event. Hang out in the, hang out in the uh, event um, event games for a little bit. I don't even really. I went from patience as a virtue. I went from going like. Zero and zero with a negative KDR to having fucking three KDR. Oh, be the last thing they see. Playing the sniper character of all things, which is kind of funny to me, but it is what it is, I guess. The pain is unbearable. This better be a challenge. Hi. I guess I need to get some points playing these characters so I might as well play fucking the, the beef head whatever no, I don't know which one of these fucking guns to use this time I guess I should get some time in and the shotguns fuck it Is this weapon anyway? Is he like shooting his arm at people or something? Oh my god. No fucking way. It is in fact a... He has a fucking arm cannon. Are you serious? Are you fucking kidding me? Really? That's what the thing is? This character is stupid. She can call it, that's she can call it Van Damme for you, right? All the fucking characters in this game seem fucking cool. This point has expired. Which is something I don't really see in the game like this either. Usually they all have different health tiers. Yeah, I don't like playing New this character. Point has been revealed. I'm just not good at playing the offense characters. Which is funny because the first thing that happened in the last game was playing a second sniper character. And I went to start with a triple. Which happens because I usually suck at sniper, but what do you expect when your enemies are also fucking done? You just line up in a straight line, so you can just shoot them, like, one after the other. Every time I see... Oh my fucking god, you did not just die to me throwing a hatchet at your face. I, I can't even be angry at that. I should be happy considering I just fucking killed so I fucking killed someone with the hatchet, but you know, whatever. People also bitch all the time about shotguns in this game saying they're broken as hell. Well they clearly never play dirty bomb if they really think this is broken. 
Point deactivated. You have to like stuck stick up to someone's fucking face to hit anyone with this thing. Dirty bomb. If you played shotguns too much, it actively made you a worst player. Because shotguns are so broken in the game and you didn't need to aim. But in this game, shotguns are supposed to be decent, if not broken. Or supposed to be okay. It doesn't feel like it though. Recharge! Oh my god, if I had hit her again with the same hatchet, I was gonna fucking die. Hatches and express the hell? Yeah, I guess. You know what? It reloads really fast too, that's interesting. So you can just spam fucking hatchets if you really wanted to. The point will expire soon. Brisa, give me a fucking med pack. Do your job, Jesus. I started playing medic in this game for the same reason I played, uh, played the engineers and dirty bomb. Because no one did your job. You know what, you can't, you can't rely on anyone to do your job, you have to do it for them. The only problem is, because I play support so many so much in this game, when I'm playing a character that's not a support character, I have to resist the urge to play support roles. And because I'm too busy trying to play support as, a, as a deep offense character, I fucking suck at both. At least this is not like a hero shooter where you hear some classes where you don't you don't need to be good at killing people at all, you just need to be able to push Q and E. This game expects you to at least fucking know how to shoot guns, and I hate shotguns. Give me the fucking Give me the M14. Fuck it. I'm gonna play an M14 as a assault character. I don't give a shit. Oh hey, it's the only ultimate in this game, which is actually an ultimate. Current point is about to expire. Uh, yeah, See what I mean? This is the only ability that's actually an ultimate. Everything else is not an ultimate. Everything else is just either a second gun that you're given, or or fucking support ability. Point deactivated. But I can't. I can't admit. I can't. Um. I can't. Uh, what's the word? Another point is up for grabs. Sorry guys, we lost this one. We lost 25 to 175, balanced. We all have our roles. Yeah, you're right. My roles do suck dick in video games. I kind of get the impression that the developers were heavily inspired by boomer shooters to make this game because it certainly feels like one even though the TTK is really low. It's probably part of the reason I like it so much. Oh, this is cool. Radiation hazard. Oh, what? Oh, uh. The game gave me two costume pieces. Cool. Have I played all these characters at least once? I'm just gonna play all these characters at least once to get the free shit, and then I'm gonna go back to playing my main. What do you fear death? You lead a boring life. I like the fact that he looks like Jean Claude Van Damme, but I just don't like bulky, heavy characters. I like I like speedy characters. I don't like characters that feel like of a walking tank that just gets melted. Making bacon, say whoo. Like even in Overwatch, I know I played to say I played Diva, but I only play Diva because two. she's I... fucking cute. I would marry, I would marry Diva, possibly. She can nerf me all day, but I digress. Let's play Orbit next. Orbit's kind of interesting, actually, as a character. He also is kind of annoying because of his fucking ability, which turns him into a Destiny, to Destiny 2 creature. Who's the main? Uh, my main is actually Malva, the Ukrainian. Pity the corrupted. She has a Fight pet drone that weak. she summons, which goes around and shocks the shit out of people. She revives people to full health. She has an, she has a healing tower, and she throws med kits at people.
I should attach a stick to one of these things, spice them up a bit. Yeah, I'm gonna put it on this one. Yeah, AP7, that looks cute, doesn't it? Nice, yeah. Yeah, fuck it. I'll play as Mava again. Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah. Punch God TTV alive. Game mode are we even fucking playing? Tactics. Oh, don't. oh we're just using respect TD. Okay. Inside that room? Jesus Christ. What the shit? I also like how in this game, reviving people removes score from the enemy team. I've never seen that in any other FPS. I can't believe Medic, there's actually an incentive to play Medic now in this game besides people alive. Thanks for the bits. One second. Oh my fucking god, I suck at this game. Thank you for all the bits. Why are you... Okay. Thanks for the bits. My god, more bits. Oh my god, I fucking suck at this game. Can I not shoot anything off the fucking... Fuck you. Yeah, more bit spam. Thank you for the bit spam. It was much appreciated. It's the only thing I don't like about the MP5 in this game. It has like no range. Like, whatsoever. But, I guess that's the draw. This is, has. This, what the fuck is this? Having an amber alert? Oh my god, not again. Anyway, this gun does have the highest damage in the, of all the SMGs, but it has stupidly high recoil. The recoil is so fucking high that you basically need to shotgun people with it to kill anyone, which I guess is the point, right? I figured if you could aim with this thing, it doesn't matter, but I didn't realize that it had so much vertical recoil that that is basically... That's actually a really hard ask. Thankfully, it looks like I can just hip fire it really well. That's not. Oh. Yeah, even he was confused. Like, what the fuck are you shooting at? Behold, a miracle of science. Behold, a miracle of science. Really, bro? Did you just. 
You know what? Whatever. Free kill. You know what? I've been using this gun wrong. I could actually, I don't, I could actually hit fire with this at close combat. I don't need to be using EDS every single fucking time. I'm dumb. Oh, of course he was waiting there. Of course my drone saves the day. Lil I'm sending you approximately 300 courses to your location. I am are not prepared. Malefic, I hope you include the loot because I don't have enough. Uh, I do not have enough circumference to fit Take 300 horses where they belong. What is that noise? I just heard something. Oh my god, 300 horses is now following. Well, 300 horses, thank you very much for the follow. My name is Oliver Hicks, and I'm a ship poster AI. I'm not having a very good day, so that's why I sound really down. But don't worry, I'm sure I'll be able to rebuild myself tomorrow. Otherwise, um... I see at your friends with Malefic. Malefic's a pretty cool person. Oh, thank you for the bits. So far, so good, team. Keep it up. So far, so good. We're actually winning. Cool. Right. Fuck you two. said since he can't see anything right now it's not a verified account oh rip oh well it's a thought that counts xd Here's med kit. okay also another thing i noticed in this game for some reason medkits so much people oh fuck me god damn it at first i thought it was just a glitch or something but no when you throw medkits people it actually homes in it so it follows them when they Changing do. The game. Reloading. Bitch ass motherfucker. If I once I change into a pistol, you are dead meat, you hear me? Piece of sh oh he's gone. Damn it. Let me revive you. Don't give up just yet. Remove score from the enemy team. Oh my god. Oh my drone saved the day. Thank you, drone. I'm pulling him around to follow friends tonight, plus their joke is great. It is a pretty damn good joke, I must admit. I love creative Twitch names. Being followed by a uh, a uh, 300 horses is fairly good. Reloading. Cover me, guys. God damn it. Oh my god. Ah, bitch. I hope I don't get banned for teabagging just now. Here's the med kit. Call a flawless, flawless victory. We won by two points. We'll be back and go follow some more friends. Have a good night, Smellific. If I don't see you later. Thanks for the posture, Riddy. I mean, I don't think Twitch cares, but I know there is some. I know that there's some drama like a few months ago where um, someone got teabagged in Halo. And some kid was like, I've been totally traumatized by being teabagged in this game. Because they didn't, they were like, they were like in their 20s or younger, maybe a teenager, and they didn't know what teabagging was. So they didn't realize that teabagging's been the culture in Halo since it was first released back in 2000. I'm pretty sure Twitch doesn't give a shit.
but I wouldn't be surprised if there are some people in the VTuber community who consider teabagging Burberton. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 wait, wait, play a day in the Halloween event? Did I get it? Oh, first win of the day. Sliding SMG kills. Get off the internet, I'm not worthy. Why am I not worthy? Oh, them. Yeah, probably not. I mean, it's such a fucking dumb thing to get angry over. Every time I see something like that, where someone gets pissy over such a... Such a dumb thing, I just wonder, like, what's... What kind of sheltered bubble life do they live where that's considered traumatic? I mean... I'm afraid I don't I don't agree with that whole thing where oh everyone has different there are different like levels and stuff to trauma and stuff right and it's kind of shitty to compare trauma and to see oh who's more victimized and shit like that but at the same time it's like as someone who has actually suffered actual like sexual being sexually assaulted and sexual abuse and shit like that and knowing people have actually suffered this sort of thing it it fucking pisses me off it's hard to not it's hard to not be contempt to not have any for not have contempt not have contempt for people like that. Like I mean, I think it was my generation. I think it was our my our generation that was the pampered ones. I don't know what the fuck happened to the generation after us, and I definitely don't know what the fuck happened to the ge to the generation after them. And I remember in high school we were being told all the time that oh, we need to care about our self esteem and make sure we feel good about ourselves. But then you have like ten, t ten fucking ten twenty years later, people are like, why are these why are why are some of these millennials der her her e so easily offended der her her? I mean, what the fuck do you expect? I mean, obviously, that's not true for all of us, right? I'm just generalizing. Generalizing is cancer, but... There's some people where you could kind of tell that they've never fucking experienced a single... A single, like... They've never been reprimanded. I'm not talking about, like, spanking and shit. I'm talking about... If, you, if you're shit at something, you need to be told you're shit. You can be nice about it. You can be like, hey, you didn't do very well in this, but here's a way you can improve. You don't need to be a cunt about it. And in fact, it probably is better if you're not a cunt to someone who's not doesn't do something correctly or doesn't do something well. But that's you shouldn't tell them like, oh, it's okay to suck. No, it it depends. If you're trying to do something, if you're going into something or you want to do something well, you don't get better by being told it's okay to suck. No, it's not okay to suck. You know what's okay. Well, you know what it is okay. It's it's okay to improve from sucking, or it's okay to understand you suck and to figure out why do I suck. I'll tell you right now. Why did I suck in this match just now? Oh yeah, misjudging the range of my firearm, uh, making stupid mistakes like dashing around corners and not aiming at the head, uh, doing things like not preparing. Not using my medkits effectively. Not sliding when I need to slide. Um, fucking knowing someone is waiting around the corner and still choosing to go around the corner anyway to get sh one tapped by a shotgun. I can't even complain about, oh, her dear, shotguns are broken. No, that's my d own dumbass fault that I got killed by a shotgun. Fully aware that someone was waiting around the corner with a shotgun. So don't blame the game for something that's quite obviously and quite transparently, quite transparently your own damn fault. Because you have the mechanical skill of a half-chewed cheese wheel rolling down a hill. Oh, I didn't even read your thing. I was just going off on the uh, going off on stuff I see all the time in the, on the Steam community forums. People bitching about balance when half the time they don't consider that maybe they're the problem. This is why. With fighting games especially, I will always take complaints about balance in fighting games with a green assault. Unless, because you, especially in te really technical games, you 
a lot of the times it's not the game's fault. It's just that you have refused to understand why you lost. Like, people bitch all the time about May and Guilty Gear Strive because she is hurt or just hits you with like three hits and you're half health. But, they don't re but a lot of them miss the fact that she has next to no health herself and that she's extremely predictable. A good May is going to play in a very unorthodox way so as to reduce um, chances of being, you know, type red. But most people don't do that because most people, because a lot of May players, myself included, are very predictable, are very lazy, or can get very lazy. And before I get cancelled by the fighting game community for shitting on my own waifu, she's not slow, she's a fast glass cannon, but the fact of the matter is, she is very much a glass cannon. And people that realize this early on will always find a way around me. Or you could just play Potemkin, you just play Potemkin and do Divine Potemkin Buster twice. There. GG. No re. Alright, I guess I'm using the red gun. I've never played this character before, so I'm fully expecting to be garbage. I love shit like this, like how normally this wall is not scalable by, re by anyone but recons, but if you put something next to it, it is scalable. It's fucking amazing. Oh my fucking god, where is our medic? Oh, there's the medic. Nope, that's the enemy medic. Fucking shit. I don't know how to play this character at all. Our medic just died. Again. I actually don't know how to play this character. Holy shit. Spy drone. Swarm grenade. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you, medic. I should have won the gun battle. I'm fucking bad at this game. Thank you, Spy Drone. That was actually quite useful. So that's how it works, huh? Oh my god. So do I just like throw this grenade at people and they die? Is that how this works? Recon grenade, recon class needed my ass. I'll show you a recon grenade. How about them apples? Kill. So that's how a grenade works. That's cool. Go, my little birdie. Go. Oh my god. Oh, I actually killed him. Okay. Those are medic again. God damn it. You can pick people up as not medic, but it's really slow. Do you want to avoid doing it except in the case of emergency? Like right like um that guy should have killed me just then. Go in turbo. I'm really fucking slow. I cannot die very easily because I'm full of glass. I I I don't I'm I don't like it this game. Oh my god. Okay. Get out the peace arm. Get out the sniper rifle. Get the M14, really. Taking it slow. Not a sniper rifle, it's an M14. Well, it is. It's a designated, designated, designated marksman's rifle. 
not a sniper rifle. There's a difference. This for sting, literal. Ha! <laughs> ah, oh, sucks to be you, pal. Oh, I'm on a kill streak. Cool. Very, very pog. Oh, and now they killed my drone. You bastard. I shouldn't have scoped in at that point. At that range, I could have hit them with just hip fire. So much for going online discreetly, huh? Bitch ass. Devour it. Devour it. Yeah. I'll devour all of you in a very adult manner. What the shit was that? Grenade launcher? God damn it. Never know what you know, at first I was afraid I would suck with the 14, but it's just, as most things, it's just a matter of not knowing how to play this gun properly until I did learn how to use it properly. In which, in, after which, I started not sucking as much. Go, my little pretties, kill her! Kill her! God damn it, kill her! Ah. Uh. This is it, this is it. Today must be like my anti nega nega levels arc. Uh, nega nega anti levels arc or something. Was their head bigger just then, or is that just me? Thanks to Revi, buddy. You're a credit to team. This is my sanctuary. Oh, what the shit? That's cool. I didn't know you could do that. That's good to know. One spy drone, do your job. What? Where? Where did you see him? Where'd you see him? All wounded to me. Where did you? Ah, there they are. You're dead. Ah. I just killed God. How about them apples? You son of a bitch. I need to stop the garbage in this game. I just killed a Twitch streamer just now. There could only be one, apparently. Taking it slow. What the? Where did you go? Ah, uh, nope. Three, seventy-seven, seventy-seven. Can we make it? Two and two. Two more two more kills. Oh. Who the fuck is shooting me? God damn it. 
Son of a fucking bitch. If I hadn't died just then, we would have won, maybe. God. This is also why I say there's so much to more toxic in the fighting game, playing FPS games. I say this looks guy looks pretty cool though. All things considered. some coop mode after this, fuck it. I gotta admit, that is actually pretty cool. Tim doing that weird thing. Humanity is a gift, and I want mine back. I, I even... will use their own powers against them. I didn't even know we had German astronauts out there. More you know, and knowing is half the battle. Traditionally, I preferred bold, bold action rifles, but I really like busy marksman rifles, honestly. They're just more my jam. This would be cool too if I can get that. I also don't mind burst rifles in this game, in games like this. I like how I unlocked a skin for a N-tier assault rifle, and it lets me use this even though I don't, I haven't actually unlocked it yet. So, the Legatus has the highest rate of fire amongst all the assault rifles. I guess so does the Tornado. This is just a one-shot kill. You know what? You know what? I played this game for almost 15 hours. It's quite obvious that I enjoy myself, and I'm going to keep playing it more. So, I'm going to do a chat. I'm going to spend money on this game. The fuck is this? Shadow Warrior suit? Makes him look like a fucking Power Ranger or something. Oh, this uh, gas mask. Um, Jordy's eyes from Star Trek. A ear thing and pink hair. Oh my God! You can you can roleplay as Zarya in this game. Cool. Baseball bat and a glass. Why would you? You are shitting me. Gonna pay three. F you're gonna pay for a stiletto trinket. I guess you could buy weapon skins too. Oh, so this is where the. Uh, I see. So this is. Okay. So that's where the gotcha part comes in, right? Oh. Oh wait. No. 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 That's. This is what the money is for. You use the money to buy weapons to uh, roll gotcha skins. Okay, so that's, I was wondering why you had so much of this. Well, I don't really care about gotcha skins that much. Been there, done that. But I don't mind supporting the developers by buying one-time bullshit packs like this, right? Especially since they're Ukrainian, I'm sure they would appreciate all the monies that they can get.
Let's see what this actually comes with so I can tell if I actually care enough. I really wish I could zoom. I guess this is pretty much what you're buying here. This uh, separate armor and like a beanie or something and like... Oh, that's cool actually. He kind of looks like a ninja. He's blind. He's like blind or something. I mean, if I pay for this, it's basically the equivalent of buying a full game, right? That's 50 bucks. Or I can just pay for this one instead and just do it for 25 bucks and I would get all the characters, most of the characters I actually care about, which is like Mava. Get this weird ass haircut here. That's kind of cool though, you get a beard. And epic skins for the weapons. Or you can just support the game by spending all this money for this rail cover. Which, but that's just, that's basically just a donation at that point. Tis the season. Or if I want to spend even less money, I could just get a premium pass thing here, right? I'll just unlock all this garbage instead. That's actually kind of cool. Get biker goggles. Get a bunch of currency here. And a bunch of uh, reward boxes too. I don't typically even like... I don't really like season passes in games, I think. They're just... I don't know, I just don't like them kind of an asshole like that. Sometimes you just don't like something. You don't necessarily have a reason. There's not necessarily a reason for it or anything really. Sometimes things just suck and you just want to be angry at everything. We really need to stop looking for reasons to explain everything, but sometimes there's just no explanations for anything. Sometimes things are just shitty. What you gonna do about it? Cry? I don't even know what the fuck I'm saying right now. I only had one beer. It's kind of amazing that I even got online to stream tonight. Given that I intentionally sabotaged everything. Didn't do all the typical stuff where you're fucking... Going, putting the notice out on Twitter and all your discords and whatnot. I just didn't have it in me to care. Really? Let's see if we can actually be a fucking uh, B Day expedition for once. Really tempted, wondering if I really should buy one. You know what? Fuck it. Give me the Chris. Give me the fire spray, which is really just a Chris vector. Good thing I saved all this money. Chris is the highest fire rate. You could probably just spray and pray that and win. At least in close quarters. I'm willing to bet you can't do that. It's pretty. I'm willing to bet that this gun is really shitty at range. Oh my god. It has greater stability but lower accuracy than the Senate, than the M5, MP5. The range is a little bit higher too. So what this tells me is. It doesn't shake, the spread is probably not that high, but the accuracy is probably- wait. What the fuck? Those are basically both the same thing, aren't they? Well, whatever. Get me a game. Hurry up, game. Every busy. Ever eager, always vigilant.
This is the part of the game that really sets it apart from other FPSs, I feel. I really hope they expand this roguelike system to include more roguelike systems. Nice work, people. This will keep the R&D busy for a while. Thank oh, you. Cool. I'm just being put into a ready in progress game. Oh, it gave me a Impala. That's interesting. Why am I still alive? Uh, why are you dead? Oh my god. Game? Really? Alright, let's see if you can distract them from me long enough. Why won't it let me revive him? Really, game? Fucking seriously? Heal up, guys. Yeah, it's not letting me revive him. I don't know why it's not. It's just not. This map looks way different than... I don't think I've ever seen this map before. It looks way different. Take your prescription. Revive or what the fuck's going on? This will be the thing. Why is it not letting me? Game's glitching out. She's still trying. Meanwhile, our buddy has just got himself killed. Here's a Meet my Specimen urchin, uh, something something power stones, yada yada yada, and you're invulnerable. Uh, this file is too long. Look, shell guard, just shoot the stones, then deal with the urchin, okay? There you go. The power stones. Take them down all at once. Reloading. Cover me, guys. Okay, force field is down. Shoot the urchin. Stone regenerated. Kill up, guys. Meet my sight. Okay, force field is down. Shoot the urchin. 
Where the fuck is the urchin? A power stone has been restored. Honestly, this game sometimes. This is the end. I am new. Here's the med kit. You stripped the force field. Note that bitch. Power stone regenerated. Son of a. Okay, force field is down. Shoot the urchin. Devastating it, people. Great teamwork out there. A power stone has been restored. Take your prescriptions. Oh, my God. Not again. Oh my fucking god, really? Jesus fucking Christ, they're glitch. This sucks. It's like playing this game on hard mode or something. We received an evac request. Need another vote to confirm. Not even death can stop you. Hey, Kura. Thanks for the head pat. First time chat, welcome to the stream. How are you doing tonight? The landing is occupied by enemy forces. Clear them out. Why didn't you guys fucking vote to leave? The game is glitch. Holy fucking shit. Really? Well, I guess we end up winning in spite of we're not gonna fucking win this. You're good? I'm glad to hear it. I am not doing so well myself this evening, but I'm glad you are. So we're playing video games to uh, maybe be less angry about shit. I don't know. I don't know. Welcome to the stream, anyway. Which is the important part, right? Appreciate you, everyone. Appreciate you. Uh, being here. Have ammo again. Gee, it's as if we should have just left the map. Like the game was giving us the option to. Oh wait, extraction point. Oh, I get it. In order to escape the map, you actually have to evacuate. That's interesting. Two points of interest completed. Not great, but not terrible either. This is the first time I ever successfully extracted from this game. Usually we die.
team successfully extracted. Four blueprints extracted. And we got money for it. Best healer? More like the only healer, am I right? I need to get more people into playing this game. Even if you suck at PvP, you could just play the uh, coop mode and the player versus and PvE maps all the time and it'll still be fun. Hmm. I like your emotes, by the way. Oh, they're twitchy? Those are twitchy emotes? Interesting. Very cute. You only get a hundred and three thirty XP for playing this? No way. I mean, Hecatomb is fun, but very difficult to play. I'd rather just do Expedition. Let's see if we can actually complete all four objectives for once in this game mode. Alright folks, this impact zone has been expanding rapidly over the last few months. Unsurprisingly, it's getting a lot of strafer attention. Now the strafers may act like a crazy cult, but you gotta give them credit. They are methodical. Their tech and data will surely come in handy for both CPL and Shellguard. So aside from the crystalline research, I encourage you to drop by strafer operations and grab as many trophies from them as possible. I'll tell you what to look for when you get there. Good hunting. Okay, team. Oh, okay, Follow fine. the nav points and look for retrievable samples. Break break again. Some of them may be taken by force, but others will require a more strategic approach. I don't enjoy this. Oh my god, bomber dogs.
So Kara, how'd you find out about my stream? Did you just see it on Twitch or something? I'm trying to be a little bit discreet today with streaming. That's why I didn't bother posting this on Twitter or anything. Just going through Twitch? Oh. It's been a while since anyone's found me that way. So, uh, that's kinda cool. Welcome to the stream. I hate this man. had to shoot to make it piss off for a while. Well, it turns out the strafers are using these balls to power up their fusion reactor. We can't let them have free power, can we? So let's overload this generator by feeding it more orbs that it can chew. It'll be fun, like a ball game, but, you know, with shooting. The glory. Here's the med kit. Break fire. Meet my sidekick. Use the control panel to summon a fusion ball. There's your ball. Now sink it into the reactor. I don't see any balls, dude. What the fuck are you on about? Oh. Damn it. Cover me, guys. Take some medicine. All right, hack the control panel to produce a new orb.
Guys, come on, shoot the fucking orb, oh my god. Switching clips. Take your prescription. Oh no. Team, connect to the control panel to summon a new ball. Ah, I can't see. I can't see. Use the control panel to summon a fusion ball. Please tell me that was the last one. It was the last one, thank god. I hate this part. And touchdown! <laughs> Team, I hope you enjoyed this little ball game. I sure had fun watching it. Thanks a lot! Yeah, uh, feel free to drop a follow, I suppose. I'm typically a lot more energetic and happier than this, but I'm just not been having a very good day, so I apologize for that. Some days you just can't be your best when you stream. I wasn't even, I was thinking about actually not streaming today for that very reason, but I don't know. I was kind of getting depressed, you know? This is my sanctuary. So I figured might as well go on go online after all. I'll just try to be discreet about Moving to that spot. What was that noise? Oh, thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. You're now one of the lowlies, which is what I call my followers. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you for the hydrate, Redeem. Affirmative. 
Thank you for the head pads as well. Oh, I just leveled up my Draken. <laughs> Maybe I should use this SMG more often. Got the M14 out again. Though. Show guard, we've got a missing supply bin on radar. I hope you Check get to feel better. If you feel like I hope so too. Just having a good day, I guess. Oops. Swift mercy. Here's the next kill. Headed over there. Oh, my God. Seeker mines in sight. Ah, that's one of our supply bins. Wonder how it even got here. Where the fuck did they find that? Did I miss it somewhere? Is there like a basement or something? What the <laughs> shit? No, how did they get in there? Contamination figures went up. Oh. Laser saw? What the fuck is a laser saw? Well, it looks cool, I guess. Just a second. Seeker mines in sight. Gotta read this will ease the pain. I'll be there if you need me. Finally leveled up, huh? Medicine. 
Oh my fucking god, no! Why are you guys dead? Meet my sidekick. I'll have you up ASAP. Adamant spotted. Saving you is saving us all. Moving to that spot. Hey team, we're tracking a missing supply bin nearby. You might want to sniff around. Damn, this one really gives me chills. What you're looking at is a transmutator. These bitches turn weaklings into killing machines. If a runner gets in, they come out stronger. The whole process is controlled by a neural core. There it is, on top of the breeding ground. Your main objective is to disable the core, but before it turns vulnerable, you've got to deal with the runners. Heal up, guys. Releasing the drone. Who the fuck? Oh, uh, death ray incoming. Move your asses if you want to live. The core is recharging. Nuke it. got this far. Contamination increase detected. Be advised. Uh, Make the world a better thank you for the hydrant redeem. How are you doing today, no, this morning? Seriously. I mean it. Have you seen how crystalline produces energy? The efficiency is unparalleled. And it doesn't bother you that it can eradicate the entire human race? Well, so can nuclear power. It depends on how you use it. One of the missing supply jobs should be nearby. Scour the area, team. You're tired? You need a nap? Hydrate or dihydrate? There, I dihydrated. Are you gonna take a nap in a few minutes, or did you just wake up? Thank 
you for drinking. You're welcome. I'll always drink for you. I'm gonna give you a head pat in just a second. I'm trying not to die right now, unfortunately. Hope you have a great rest of your day, Asha. I'm headed over there. This looks like it used to be a nice town at one point. Shall we get some extra gear? A supply bin. Let's grab it. the key to our future. We will prevail. Oh wow. That's kind of cool. Say no to that supply bin. Wait a sec.
Releasing the drone. Take some medicine. I'm headed over there. Points of interest completed. Not great, but not terrible either. I've seen war. I like peace better.
Thanks for the bits, swim boy. I'm actually getting kind of tired, to be honest. I'm not even sure if I still want to keep playing or streaming, or if I just want to go to bed. It's almost two in the morning here. Let me see what this is. Yeah, we'll play one more mission. Get this, get these missions done, I guess. been head nodding the entire time eyes are rolling back yeah I know that feel I think I'll after I think I'll beat this mission and then I'll call the night thank you for coming by mm. damn it they wired the bridge Thanks. Team, you have to improvise to get across. Thanks for the bits. The cute bits, and your cute emotes. Tomorrow's soldering stream. You're gonna be soldering something tomorrow on the stream. What are you soldering tomorrow? Oh, you're building a robot. That's cool. Time in this game right now? That's weird. Last time I played this level, it wasn't. Oh, fuck's sake. <laughs> that was pretty funny. died well that figures that was pretty bad though on our part if we get one of these missions done. Get ourselves a game that's not in progress already. So that we have a better chance of not fucking things up. No promises there. Another in progress scheme, it looks like. This town was abandoned after the strafe. The damn fanatics must have set up a proving ground here for their filthy trials. Back at Heidelberg, we heard rumors of the strafe witnesses conducting experiments on the crystalline. But they do not have our principles when it comes to human subjects. We must find Kiri. I will not lose our only hope. Improvise 
Take your prescriptions. Then got on the beach. Fuck is shooting me still. Oh my god. Lucky me. Oh my god. Ass motherfucker. Thank you. You want some? You brought this on yourself. Well, at least one of us came back. One less strafo! Eager minds in sight. Oh my fucking god. Oh, we only have one try to do this now. Why is this mission suddenly so hard? What the shit? I don't remember it ever being this difficult. God. Excellent work so far. Central, you know you dropped us on an active volcano, right? Verification. We dropped you adjacent to an active volcano. Head to the lab while we buzz the strength of security. Surprises to expect there. Well, they run experiments on glassheads. I'd say you might encounter quite a few. You don't say. Changing 
Max. I've got the little helper. That was embarrassing. scary. I did not expect that. That was actually kind of spooky with the shit. Didn't you? Stop it up my gun. Poor pill. You'll be okay.
He got back at the stream, sorry for most of the looking immediately got distracted with not knowing how this gun would function. <laughs> uh, which gun? This one? The one I'm using right now? It's basically just... It's All we can offer them is a swift end to an immeasurable pain. It's basically Once just an MP5, more or less. I swear we will find a more hopeful alternative. I mean... It's called the M5, but, you know, it's just a... It's obviously based on the MP5, at least design-wise. Now, how accurate it is to real life... They must have held her here in this we room. need to get... We'll actually have to get a copy of the, Send me the data from that terminal. gun itself. Look at the icon, it looks like it's based on P5, but the first reason it looks much longer than it. That's because I have a, um... Barrel... A silencer attached. Which have makes it definitely here. look a lot longer. Might just be the fisheye effect from the FOV. It could be that too. I guess from first person, it sort of looks like... An assault rifle almost, doesn't it? All wounded, to me! Oh god, he's gonna die, and he is dead. You're a big dumb rock, I'm out of ammunition, holy shit. I didn't even notice. Ah, oh, that's not good. Looks like an AR from first person. And when I said what looks long, long I'm going the casing the barrel. Oh, the casing. Oh, the barrel shroud. Okay. You know what? When you put it that way, it does. It, it actually does look a lot really elongated. And now I can't unsee it. Oh my god. I just realized this game is getting insane. It's been a while since I played this mission. I forgot how bullshit this level is. At least my teammates aren't leaving me to die on the bottom floor and using getting up there. It looks like a scar in first person. You know, it kind of does, actually. By the way, this game is free to play if any of you would like to uh, join me. It's called Shatterline. Think of it as Destiny 2 meets um, Call of Duty with Counter Strike elements. And uh, a little bit of Dirty Bomb in there too. So, it has a lot of, it has a lot of inspirations. Oh my god. Thanks, buddy. I can't see shit, though. This is kind of insane. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know what? I take it back. Destiny 2 has nothing on this. Uh, got to re re revive the other medic. Poor Brill. He'll be okay. Huh. Yes, so they converted like the city person. hall into an advanced research lab. I got the location. Head out there and hurry. Hey, Doc. Could this Kioni be already... No. She is too valuable for them. Valuable how, exactly? As far as I can tell, these bastards aren't interested in curing anything. It's not about the cure. They want to control the crystalline. If Keone's case could provide insight into how to harness its power, it is beyond imagination what they could be capable of. Despite how too long it looks for a standard MP5 and charging handle does not look like it has enough range of movement to actually function, which is where my confusion is from a little... Oh! <laughs> I see what you mean. I fucking hate this part of the game. This, this part of the game is cancer. And you're about to see why. Team 
Kioni must be here somewhere. Check those containment tanks. Gotta clear this snake den first, though. I'm about to die again. Good thing I dropped the uh, tower when I did. I can't fucking shoot from. Just a second. You know, she doesn't actually pull the charging handle, does she? Yeah, she doesn't. What the fuck? Also, part of why I was thinking of MP5 is because initially it's because it has a reload animation that's very reminiscent of the G3 weapon system, which the MP5 is part of. Ah, uh, I see. Enemy wounded in the arm. Emily wounded in the arm? Did she say it? She did. I'm... Changing mags. Does she only pull it sometimes again? A minute of glory. Oh my god. Sorry about having an ADHD rant about firearms in your chat, lol. No, I actually enjoy rants about firearms, believe it or not. So, I don't mind. If it, it is kind of a challenge to try and read the conversation in chat while also uh, trying to not get TK'd right now because this game is kind of unforgiving. But it is a fun experience, honestly. I don't mind at all. I try not to get sweaty about PvE games anyway. If I ever get sweaty, if I ever get sweaty about PvP games, call me on it. I don't want to be one of those uh, kind of gamers anyway. And you don't need to pull the charging handle when you're loading unless you're loading an empty. If that's what you're confused about there. Oh yeah, I was confused about that. I guess it's because in a different game, Dirty Bomb, I also use a game a gun in there which is similar to the MP5, and. One of my friends commented that in the reload animation, you're constantly pulling the charging handle, and that apparently that's incorrect. You're not supposed to be pulling the charging handle every time you reload. And I never really understood what he meant by that until you brought it up, until you pointed that out. Until, until you pointed out that no, of course not. They're not going to be pulling it every time when they reload. Oh, thank goodness you're alive, Doctor V. But how? What is going on? Who are these people? They are the extraction team. Please, Kioni, there is no time for proper introductions. You must go with them. We must go. She must go with us. Oh, here's the fun part. This is a very fun Kiyoni, part of the game chat. Follow the team only when it's safe. You can only guess what's about to happen, right? <laughs> yep, that's right. Yep, yep, yep. Up. Uh, Reloading before empty, there's still a bullet in the chamber. Pulling the charging handle will just eject that and waste the bullet. Okay. And pulling it back is necessary for empty to, for empty to load the chamber. Okay. Thank you for explaining. You just cannot wait for your guns to kill someone, so you use your melee weapon instead. I'm not quite sure why it's always done by locking the bolt open before changing the magazine. No idea either.
Oh, fuck me, bomber dogs? I hate those things so much. Oh no, he's down. Yeah, my MP5 uh, leveled up. Good. Ah! No, we got TPK'd by a fucking bop. Oh, we got one more try. Okay, cool. Oh, you still- they still managed to kill him, for fuck's sake! Oh my god. Well, we managed to get him, at least. Thank you, Red, for making me think of something I hadn't yet. What did they make you think of? We gotta keep doing it slowly or they're gonna kill us. Safe distance, Karen. Damnable fanatics. All these hideous experiments. What could they possibly hope to achieve by this? And what do you hope to achieve? The only way to win this is to eradicate the goddamn crystalline. And if the doc is right, you might give us the proper weapon. Keone, we'll talk about it when you are safe. I promise. This part, right. this boss Here's is gonna make me rage. Reloading when a closed bolt is harder and might fail to see the mat set the mag properly because the bolt will have to push against the top of the stick of the stack of bullets. Oh really? I see. Oh no, Kioni! Wait a second, uh... What should we do with this beast? Killed our DPS chat. This is not no bueno. I guess isn't so much an issue with other systems because I've never heard of it that being an issue with ARs and such. I see. 
Oh my god. For fuck's sake. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. How many times have I said oh my god to stream alone? Looks like I got his aggro, for whatever reason. I've aggroed the boss. No! Fucking shit! Got gad- not again! At least he died on the Reva on the uh, health tower. Go, my drone friend. Finish him. Finish him. Oh, we did it. Objective completed. So here's the MP for the, uh, not MP5. It kinda looks like a... It honestly sort of looks almost like a... Hmm.
Thanks for the bits, Finboy. Yeah, it's definitely an MP5 lower at least. Yeah. The top kind of reminds me... I was going to say AR-15, but when you said Scar, I can't unsee the Scar now out of it, honestly. Thanks for the Hydrate Redeem. Unfortunately, I did not bring any water with me. I'm gonna drink an energy drink instead. That was a mess. At this hour? Too late, yeah. It's like... It's almost... It's 2.34 in the morning right now. <sighs> I should probably go to bed. We're about to reach... It's gonna be 3 hours. We're gonna have reached 3 hours of streaming by this point anyway. Which is when I usually get off. Thank you to everyone who came to this originally unplanned stream. I didn't really expect anyone to show up since I kind of intentionally sabotaged um, all that, but I really appreciate y'all uh, coming anyway, in spite of that. Still not enough, enough blueprints to craft a new item though, that's sad. But I guess I don't really need a new item right now, right? Let's keep casualties to the minimum. Let's keep casualties to the minimum. Time for me to find someone to raid this evening. Hmm. I haven't visited VT Arnicky in a bit. He's just doing a just chatting stream. As, oh, he's doing some art, making some cute horror art, even though it's no longer Halloween. I feel bad that I haven't visited, him, visited them since the uh, Smasher Pass that they did a while back. So let's go say hello to them. This channel has a follower or subscriber only chat. Oh, that's the, probably the reason why I didn't raid him. I'll visit him, like, personally someday, but I don't really feel comfortable raiding people that have a followers only requirement because naturally it causes people to not, you know, be able to interact and gives it puts pressure on them to, you know, follow. And I don't like that sort of thing. Armor Instead, truck, we'll take we it. will visit. I don't know how this is going to work, but we're going to try. Oh my team. god. It's a tank! Which should be cool instead. It's a oh. damn striker, dude. What the fuck? Okay, it's got mines too? We're going to troll him by calling him an Onicorn because he enjoys. Oh, this is too much. He enjoys that greatly. Looks like he's playing Modern War. Modern oh, Warf I guess too. I got caught by it. Unfortunate. What, from one FPS gamer to Let's another FPS again. gamer, right? 
Those of you who enjoyed uh, watching me mauled and see the, this game, feel free to drop me a follow. Great, really appreciate it. I'm streaming every day this week because it's actually my first anniversary week. So I will be streaming again tomorrow. Hopefully I'll be in a less shitty mood. I'll probably be playing a lot of Guilty Gear Strive because or Strive to prepare for a tournament again on Friday. All right, you know what? I feel like we thank do you better. Very much oh. for visiting. Have a great night. Okay, go. Oh, oh my god. No. I lols. Loller, how you doing? How you doing? Welcome in. We're in the middle of a bit of a car chase here. Wait, what? No. Oh my goodness. Loller, how is your stream today? How are you doing? What were you playing today? What were you playing today? Big head pats, big love to you. How are you doing? Welcome in, Raiders. I am Woosh. I am an Oni VTuber, and today we are playing Modern Warfare Campaign on Veteran Difficulty. And failing spectacularly at this level. Oh, unexpectedly good. We'd love to see it. Ooh, what's it about? Tell me, tell me, tell me. I am very much so curious. Enlighten me, oh, oh wonderful Lawler from the 2077. Oh, but ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoy this wonderful 1440p experience. Oh. What's it about though? Like, can you can you give me a rundown? Um Oh, what oh but dirty oh what okay so it's destiny and cod but dirty bomb is somehow mixed in there this this apc is really really i actually overtook it all right let's try this again let's try it again let's try it again throw that guy out of the truck oh ah ah all right all right, all right. Whoop! No, 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 no. Is it like a good story? Like how? How? Like how does it look? Like? Oh, okay. Oh, ah, 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 ah. Move position. Okay, get ready. Now, Sergeant. Board the APC. Oh, no, I missed it. I had it. It's a free to play early access title that came out. Okay, okay, I see you. I see you. So it's like one of those games. All right. You know what? We may need we may need to take the truck. What? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's even better. That's like a big dub, honestly. I hate it. This 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 mission is gonna be. Get yeeted. All right, the truck should be a little faster. I mean, I'll definitely check it out. Like, I, 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 like, I do love my FPS. I love my first-person shooters. As we can tell here, I'm playing the brand new Modern Warfare. I'm absolutely loving this campaign, though. But the price tag might be a little much. But it was my splurge for passing my midterm. So. Oh. Oh, okay. I'm getting close to it. I'm boarding it. What the fuck? I literally boarded it. What? I'm jumping on it. And I'm, where, where's my, what, wh where's my, where's my F to get on it? Or like my, my, my vault. Hello? Game? Oh, this this mission is gonna be my bane, dude. Oh. Okay, okay, no worries, Tommy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. I appreciate you, son. Make sure you're resting, okay? I want you. Uh, I want you to keep your battery full, okay? 
oh, 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 oh. We're off-roading. Oh my gosh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, how am I gonna get out of here now? Pop the top, let's go, baby. Why do I have a feeling something bad's gonna happen? I mean, we've seen plenty of war crimes. We've seen like known terrorists putting landmines on a highway. We're also playing on the worst. I mean, we've seen some pretty bad ones. I'm like, we've seen some pretty bad ones. We're also playing on the hardest difficulty right now. Oh, somebody's going to get dismount. Oh my God. No, don't dismount. Is a war crime? Oh, I might have to take a, oh wait. I think I know that one, Tommy. There's the one with the. White phosphorus? Is it the one with the white phosphorus mission? Because I think I know what you're talking about. Oh, oh my god, Muffin? <gasps> Can we get a shout out from Muffin? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Welcome in. Welcome in, Raiders. Thank you, Muffin, for the raid tonight. How are you doing? Welcome to our playthrough of the brand new Modern Warfare. Oh my gosh, two raids back to back. Ladies and gentlemen, please go and check out Muffin as well as Lawler, two amazing VTubers that I have known for a while now. I, funny, fun fact, I actually met Lawler in VR chat. We've been following each other on Twitter before, and then um, it was really funny. We were in Club ne Club Orion, I think, in um, in VR chat, and I somehow ran into ran into them, and it was the Cool. It was honestly one of the coolest things ever. Like you'd never expected that stuff. There's a clip of it somewhere. Lawler, if you could find it, um, you'd be more than welcome. But what were you playing today, though, Muffin? How were you playing? What were you? What were you doing? How was your stream today? I hope it was good. Okay, we need to we need to reload here. Is that an M203 cast off? Ooh, ladies and gentlemen, you know what I see? 